this is how you pirate. If there were any, ever any questions out there in the world on how does one pirate, behold. Oh, perfect timing of parrot. This... What is going on again, Nerd Paraders? Thank you guys so much for coming back to hang out with us today. We're playing some more Atlas, picking up where we left off in the last episode. Oh, thank God that one disappeared. Where Cyclones are here to absolutely ruin our day. We've gotten stranded on this island as we've tried to meander from sailing away from our starter point. Uh, but we didn't make it very far because that's the town over there. We decided to set a base camp over here. We're the best pirates ever. We sail the seas for 20 solid minutes and end up basically 26 inches away from our starting point. Is the uh, is the SS OU dick I'm on, is that going to go down in a blaze of glory with these cyclones? Oh, it's well, right. I'm going to stand over here. Dude, it does. is it going to kill our base? It's coming. It's coming right for us! Anti him, I'm going in! Ah! Oh! Oh, it's painful! Okay, I'm in the eye of the hurricane right now. Don't. I. Behold! The might of Pirate Nicholas! I have destroyed the cyclone with my sheer will and mighty Wookie Wiener! Welcome to the channel, guys! Thank you so much for coming to hang out. I am Nick. This is Nerd Parade. Oh, we're... I'm so excited to play some Atlas today. We have survived. Uh, we have survived cyclones and hurricanes and tried to travel from home port, but we made it over here. Uh, we're setting up base here to where we can do our piratey related adventures for one solid reason. When we did land and realized we were super, super close to the starting town, we went ahead and decided to explore this area. There are some pretty sweet metal nodes over here that we've been whacking and we've got a smithy down. We've created some of our metal tools and we're advancing pretty well into our, our pirate dumb. We're advancing very, very well into pirate dumb. And uh, one minor setback that we did have is that when we signed in, all of our stuff kind of had reset. So we had to use the respec icon here on our characters and I decided to go full on intelligence. I'm going to be the smartest pirate that ever pirated up Pirate Town. We're going to use our, our wisdom to craft better gear. And I ended up going down the armory tree. So my character is going to be a specialized blacksmith. Crafting armor for all of our crew. And uh, oh my god, I might be able to learn this. I can't. Oh, I had just enough points. I can actually make plate armor for us now. We can be pirate knights. But in the beginning of the tier, we have our basic armor, which gives us fur boots, uh, well, fur gear as covering ourselves from the cold climates, and hide gear, which is a little warm in this area, but it does make us look super piratey. I've been debating which one I want to craft more, and I think I'm going to go with the pirate one, but now that I know this guy, I'm assuming that we're going to have to make some kind of metal ingots or gather a lot of metal to break that down. But I'm very excited for it. I found my path. I found my way in the piratey adventures, and it it feels like it it's it feels like it enhances it for me. Like I I have a path that I'm choosing. It feels very uh, very MMO esque. Like you're gonna want to play this with a, a lot of your friends. Each person's gonna want to try to take a path that they specialize in, whether it be weaponry, whether it be ship riding, uh, not necessarily ship riding, you know, I'm riding my ship, but ship right to build the ships and things of that nature, as well as someone who's constructing. Let's collect some of this metal, and I'm gonna get super fat. Yes, I'm slightly super fat, and we're gonna take it back to the base area and the SSOU dick I'm on. Fire. It actually completes the full name, which I'm very happy, but if I hit end, does it function like arc? No, it doesn't. It doesn't actually hide the creature names if they're too terribly far away. For science, we must test all these things. But I'm joined here again with mine and Yoda, helping me sail through the seven or eight or nine or however many seas there are on the Atlas. And mine, you've kind of decided which path you're going to go down as well, right? Yep, I'm going to be a shipwright and a pirate. A shipwright and a pirate. So what, is the, what does the pirate actually do? You like grapple hooks and like nooses and stuff like that. Oh, so you're like full on uh, torture kind of stuff. Like you could you could be our torturer. If we ever capture any prisoners, you're the guy that we're going to go to to rip off fingernails and pull out teeth and 
uh, sing Justin Bieber songs. Well, and put people in cages. Okay, that most important part is putting people in cages. I like that. And Yoda, you've kind of figured out which path you're going to go down as well. Farming and guns. Farming and guns. Our crew is coming together. We've all got, like, different paths. Uh, the armory path seems to kind of intersect with a lot of the building stuff, I've noticed. Because you have to have some basic building stuff to get to, boop, 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 like metallurgy, and then, boom, armory. So... We do need to make forges if we want to wear plate. And that's one of the things I want to try to advance to today. Since we're claiming this territory as our own, the territory of the crusty sea winches, under the fearless leadership of Captain Nerdbeard. Pause for dramatic effect. <laughs> <laughs> and nobody else responding at all. The, the fearless leadership. We're going to start working on some of that. So a forge is in the in the goal, as well as some fancy new pirate digs for us. Now, the armor that we can make, the hide armor that we can make, is going to require a tannery. I already kind of checked it. It says it requires a tannery, and we have yet to make one. So that's going to be my first goal. Tannery is going to require not much more than what we already have. Carotenoid and wood. Which I don't have any on my inventory, but maybe we have some in these boxes or the smithy. Uh, carotenoid, we're good on. Perfect. And if we could just get some... Oh, God, we have a ton of wood. Perfect. There's our tannery. Well, that was super easy. I'm crafting that puppy up. Now, all this stuff does function if you're a veteran of Ark. It functions a lot like Ark, where it does require some foundation support. So we skipped past the thatch tier, since we were able to get beyond it relatively quickly, and go right into wood. Wood is damageable with metal tools. It's not with stone, but if you whack... Like, I'm gonna go... For science! Eh. Okay, wait, that, that was anticlimactic. Eh. For science. So you can damage your stuff with metal tools. So if anybody wants to come and ruin your day, it is entirely possible. Uh, stone tier does seem to be something... I've seen stone tier on trailers, so I know that's a possibility for us to advance to. So I'm keeping a, a lookout for that and how difficult that's gonna get be to get to. Anyway, dropping our tannery. How do you feel about about right here? About right here? About right there. <laughs> <laughs> about right here? About right there. That, that's good. It's a good oh, Did I mess it up? No. Is it half on, half off? Yes, I can put the walls up. Oh, no. Oh, and I can pick this up. I can pick it up. Hang on. Pick up tannery. Got it. Okay. It gave us... Ready. Perfect. It gave us the, uh, the, oh, the perfect oh shit timer. It's 30 seconds of oh shit I messed up. So we were able to do that. Uh, I just gotta find you again. Perfect. Here we go. Put you on the hot bar. Oh yeah, we're making it. We're making this. Uh, we're making this house a hole. I was just thinking it was gonna be a platform. Pirates don't need walls. <laughs> or, or, but apparently we are gonna get some anyway. Boop, boop. I do like the building. I like the arrows for the X Y Z access. 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 All right, I'm done. I'm placing the damn tannery. Let's make some cool pirate gear. Uh, we need the hides, we need the fives, and we need the more hides and the more fives. Oh, I am still super fat. I'm the $60 billion bearded man. I look crusty as... <laughs> You're dancing in the background! I can't deal! The the dancing is my favorite. I Oh, you've got you've got stuff made! Oh yeah, I've been making stuff ready to place everything Oh, you've, you. you've got stuff made made. Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna... We've got it made in the shade here. So you've got... Get all, get all in there. T, 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 T it all in. You've got the tiny shipyard, which is to make the tiny boats. And yes. then we've even got the big ship to where we could say we could hit this. We could hit the high seas. We might be able That's to sail. One. There is a bigger one. This is a small. This is a like a, a small, larger sh or small multi cruise ship. Yes. OK. And there's an even bigger one for the giant galleons and all that stuff. Yep. Oh, I'm I'm already I'm already full. I'm full on. Okay, let's take some of this hide. Uh, we need some of this fiber. And I'm going to get everybody some piratey gear. And we're going to look the part. We're definitely going to look the part. Uh, some more hide. Some more fiber. And let's stick all you in here and craft up whatever it is that we can. Armor. Uh, attachments. Oh, I can make the glider suit. You can? Yeah, by being an armor smith, I'm able to make the glider suit at the tannery. It's really not that expensive. Well, I can make climbing picks, so Okay, yeah. I've I've actually got one of your climbing picks on here on me here. 
climb up and fly off. Yeah, it's kind of what I'm going for. I, we just need a little bit of metal to do that. Oh hell yeah, we've got our we've got our goal, and we've got a little bit of a little bit of metal here. The only struggle is weight. Oh yeah, weight is a pain in the nads. I don't want to boost weight. I'm kind of like min maxing my character on intelligence, thinking that's going to make the armor and weapons and everything a little bit better quality. Carotenoid. I know I dropped. Ah, here we go. I know we dropped some of that off here. And boop. Mine. There's a suit in there if you want to pull it out and get your full on pirate on. Full on pirate on. Sounds weird. We're gonna we're gonna go with it anyway. Boots, legs, pants, hats, random stuff out of order that I'm creating and crafting. Show me, show me your pirate. Show me your best pirate impression. I'm getting dressed. <laughs> I I like it. Wait, ready? ready, ready? Oh yeah, I'm ready. This is how you pirate. If there were any, ever any questions out there in the world on how does one pirate? Behold, oh, perfect timing of parrot. This is how you pirate. You think we can actually get that guy? <laughs> I want oh, chickens. No, we've already tamed you chickens. I want to tame a parrot. The problem is to t <laughs> the problem is to tame the parrots. You need to get bowlers, and you need to like slightly damage them, hit them with the bola, and then shove things into their buttholes until they become your friend. It's a little difficult with what we currently have. Maybe it'll become a little bit easier along the way. Ah, a hat for me, a hat for Yoda, a glider suit. Oh, we're gonna take that out. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go playing with that guy and inevitably get myself killed. And some gloves. Full on pirate time. Boop, 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 boop. Oh yeah, I'm looking full on pirate. Takes a second for it to pop onto my body. Which I actually kind of like. I feel like this is a, uh, I feel like this is the PvP mechanic. So you notice the delay on how long it takes to put on your character. I feel like that's a gear swapping PvP mechanic. Like it, it I, I keep referencing Ark Survival Evolved because it's, kind of the engine that this game is, is built upon. But in that game, you can have a piece of gear break and you can instantly replace it. With this one, there's a slight delay so that if your gear breaks, you are very vulnerable and can get tapped. I, th I think it might be uh, an interesting element to some player versus player type stuff. Yoda, are we going to climb this puppy? I was looking for metal. Oh. Well, now I'm scared to do it alone. I, I think I can look piratey. You do look... Oh, you look piratey, too. Oh, you look way more... Where... You started making guns already? <laughs> you are the most... You are currently the most pirate that we have. I said I wanted firearms. You got them. You got them. Now, okay, now now I'm embarrassed. As as your very poorly elected captain, I feel like I have to nut up, and uh, I'm going to use my climbing pick here. I'm, I'm going to have to prove bravery. Oh, wait, no. That didn't work. I'm going to shoot something. <laughs> let, me or, know, let me know when you're gonna jump off because I'm gonna videotape it. Oh, really? Wait, we have, we have uh, medieval or piratey videotapes. Yes, I got a phone. I can I can do it in the game with the phone. Oh, gotcha. Okay, so wait, way to break the fourth wall there, buddy. Just it, <laughs> to break the immersion. We're pirating it up. I don't think I, that's way too steep. Uh, how about over here? Yeah. You know, I may not be the best pirate, but by God, I'm going to be the highest pirate. That sounds weird out of context. <clears throat> I'm being currently defeated by this one tiny rock. Ha ha ha! Get out, pirated. I might be able to just jump this. We're going to get as high as we can go. I'm going to step, step back so I can watch you come down. <laughs> The question is, how fast am I going to come down? Am I going to come down slow and gliding and happily? Or am I going to come down really, really fast and really, really unhappily and sad? They put Trapaldine down for you? Place your bets now, folks. <laughs> uh, yeah, a, tra a pirate-related trampoline would be nice. Oh, this is bad. I don't think... I don't... I can't really go anywhere else. Uh, maybe... How's my climbing pick? It's a little... It's a little damaged. Can I get up on the here? Oh, oh, good. That looks not like I'm going to be able to make it. Oh, no, I might be able to make this. This is a small little lip here. Oh, great. This is the highest I've ever been. And it's really funny that we made... 
Looking at this from up here, our grand sea adventure that we were like, oh yeah, we're, we're traveling so far. We're... Town? Our destination. Oh, what am I doing? Am I hungry? Oh, oh, we're hungry. Let's put some meat in our belly. Uh, how much higher do you think we can go? My guess is probably not that high. All right, this is about as much. This is about as good as we're gonna do. I bet I can make it all the way to the OU, the SS OU dick. I'm on fire. Uh, if I attach this to my, ar no, not on my armor. Hot bar? No, not hot bar. Oh no, yes, hot bar. Hot bar. Hot bar was right. Got to cool down. Eight seconds or four seconds. Oh, the, oh my God, it's on me. I'm dancing a jig and watching you. I'm fucking pirate Batman right now. Do you... Can you see this from up here? I you, can't see you yet. I, I don't think you can see what I look like, but this is quite amazing. I'm pirate frickin' Batman. Uh, Jump and deploy. I can show you the world. Oh, I see you now. Shining, shimmering, Bye. oh shit. This is just mouse control. This is not too bad. This is cool. I like this. Armor Smith for the win, dude. That is awesome. I will make all of you guys... I'm still gliding. Does shift do anything? Shift does... Like a slow... Mo oh, no, 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 shift is bad. Don't do shift. <laughs> I, shift was a mistake. I feel like I've been just... I just feel like I got baited really hard. Shift was a mistake. Shift slows you and then just just nosedives your ass. I was majestically sailing through the skies and then... uh No, to time to shift. I, I You have to... T you can't third person. <laughs> laugh it up. Laugh it up. <laughs> a mutiny. You bastard. Laugh it, laugh it up. You're laughing, your captain. I like how you're dancing. We have a, we've got a good crew. We've got, we've got a good crew here. Well, now that we've, you know gotten our sea wings perhaps we should work on getting our sea legs uh mind if i steal some of this stuff out of here mine and toss it into the uh into the briny deep into the ocean and see if we can make some cool ships go for it i kind of already took it without asking you sorry captain As nick you're asking <laughs> captain nick does whatever the fuck he wants this stuff this is mine uh the, now it's on the hot bar okay do we need to put down a, a claimy block in the in the waters so that we can go out far enough if it's too far from that one this says it's obstructed okay no this is actually gonna let us uh oh what does that say play can't place tiny shipyard requires placement within a territory claim of yours uh place clab uh flag claim flag to claim the territory okay yeah uh i would say probably a little deeper and then maybe about in this area. And we can place multiple flags because that flag over there is mine. Or do we, do I need you to place a flag and we, we go from there? Well, oh, for, we're on the same team, so. For science, I'm going to try to place my flag really quick. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah. E okay, yeah. No, no, it let me... Oh, holy crap, it's going fast. Uh, Yeah, it let me place another claim flag. It's a buoy. In a barrel, and it is counting down lightning fast because it's already in our territory, I guess. Yeah, I think so. Right next to another one. So it's not the 10 minute countdown that the other flag has. Yeah, boom, this is it. This is ours now. Successfully claimed. That was lightning fast. Uh, all right. Then we'll stick our dude here. Okay, perfect. Now we've got a little rafty thing. And then if we can. I know this one place is a little wonky. We got to get it. The water is too deep. Uh oh. <laughs> I figured this would have to be deeper. Uh, so the water is a little. Oh yeah, no, we can place it over here. I just want it to face out in the ocean. So how about? Aha. How about we do like so? Oh, the water is too deep. There we go. So this requires nice. water that's deep-ish, but not too deep-ish. And it'll let you place. So we've got this facing out into the ocean. We can sail into that horizon. And we've got our little mini dinghy for mini dinghies and other types of rafts. I didn't line it up too terribly nicely, but for the sake of what we need, we can make this work. And you can build on this, right? 
Yes, it counts as a foundation. This whole thing counts as a foundation. That's pretty awesome, actually. Uh, so we go. We need to. I don't know any shippy skills, so I can't build any ships. But you access it. You you can F on it to get into its inventory, and you build the ships right from this entire structure. And I would assume it's the same for this guy. Yep. Now my big question is: Will you be able to learn all of the things? As you eventually advance onward, will you be able to learn all of the things? Can I be a blacksmith as well as a gunsmith and a shipwright and a pirate? And, like, how much can I learn? Uh, is it going to be possible to learn everything? Or do you really need to be selective and careful with your trees? Now, every level, you do have the option to respec in case you just go down a tree that you really don't like. Which is convenient. Uh, but do you have to focus on min-maxing? And that's that's a that's usually a question that arises in any type of MMO game. With all the categories that we could choose from, I guarantee a mixing of traits is going to be required. Like medicine to heal yourself, uh, health packs or uh, first aid. I feel like that's going to be pretty much required from everybody. Captaineering, if you're going to be steering the big ships, might be important. Cooking and farming, music and dance. Who doesn't want to learn music and dance? And everybody should be able to learn piracy. But we haven't made it there yet. But we did make some pretty big progress here. Uh, forge is the next goal. We got our tannery. Forge is the next goal that I wanted to try to hit. I think we could probably accomplish that today. We've got fiber, flint, hide, metal, stone, and wood. We might actually have all of this, and it only requires 20 metals. Uh-oh. I've got bad news for us. Our, our tiny house might be a bit too tiny. Do you think we could pull out some more foundations before it gets uh, too dark? I didn't build any more. You, you didn't build any more foundations? Nope, I can make some more though if you want. Uh, Yeah, because I think this forge is going to be a little... If you don't mind, I think this forge is going to be a little bit large. There's metal. Okay. Let's search for forgy. There's our forge. Uh, and we need hides, some more stone, and wood. I think we've got that. We've definitely got the wood. Stone, flint, hide, fibers. Oh, I am really the fats. Did not expect to be the so fats. Uh, Yoda's making bullets for everybody. There's a pistol in there for you, too. <gasps> you made me a pistol. Yo We're all gonna die. No, no. Yoda just got promoted to first mate. That's what happened. Aww. That's... <laughs> That man made me a pistol. Give him a promotion. Get, you don't give him two promotions. We're pirates. We should just we should just hand out promotions if we want. Uh, what am I missing? What am I missing? Did, I, did it say hide and I missed it? Yes, hide. We can use this. Oh, fur. We'll use the fur as the hide. And we've got some more stone and literally one more fiber. There's the stone. I need literally one fiber and I can't move. Oh, I can move. Tannery. You've got to have one. Yes. Forge. Yes. Forge incoming. And I can make the foundations if I've got the stuff. Uh, wood floor. Oh, I just need more. It's all about that fiber, apparently. Two, three, four. There we go. Forge is in inventory. My goal is... Are we going to get to plate mail on episode three? I want to be a pirate knight. A knight pirate. A nigrit. A pite. We'll figure it out. They can't all be gems, but we'll figure it out. Okay, pop hey, that man, on. Our... Come here. I, I, I'm, I'm so fat right now. Why'd you pick the time that I wasn't on a diet to tell me to come here? Oh, oh, oh we got it. Okay. Uh, neatly enough, by the way, if you didn't know, you can stack foundations. I feel like that could be very useful information for the future. So we're going to keep that in our back pocket. And there. And I can't imagine that taking up more than four. So, ah, yeah. Okay, perfect. We'll, play, we'll place this nice. We're going to place this all super nice. Done. The forge. The mightiest uh, thing that we could come about. Coal, cobalt, and salt. Oh, we need lots of stuff. What is that? Uh, coal, iron? No, we just have we just have metal. Tin? Oh, we have none of this. Gems, silver. I thought this was just going to be... This is more complex than I thought. Copper... Cobalt. Oh my. So the uh, the pirate knight dreams might be slightly dashed 
Oh, I placed that perfectly. That's awesome. Capital placement there, Nick. Oh, thanks, Heather Nicholas. Our pirate night dreams might take a little bit longer than to achieve than I thought, but we've... Oh, we've got a... You've got a dinghy. Yeah, I say, come help me row it. <laughs> Show me your dinghy. I want to ride on your dinghy. I really have to stop saying dinghy. <laughs> Let's do this. Our very... Our first chip. Sit on the dinghy. Okay. So how do we do this? Row. Oh, it's not. It's definitely not W. Do, is it click? It's W. It's W. Oh, it is W. Huh. 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 It was working a second. Now it's stuck. Oh, I was anchor down. Uh, it doesn't. Wait, are we overweighting the boat? Am I too fat? I'm actually pretty fat. And I, I'm yeah, also super hungry. Uh, here, let me jump off. Let me see if you could do it. Uh oh. You're doing great, buddy. Keep it up. I'm pulling for you. We're trying out. We're, <laughs> we're trying out for the team. You ran him. Oh, what did I do? You anchored me. But, but anchoring raised the entire boat. Push, Nick. Push. Can I? Wait. What if we try to row backwards? No, the boat shows fine on weight. Oh yeah, backwards. There no, backwards works. Yay! It just doesn't like that. Gen <laughs> we can only pirate the boat backwards. Did I, I and by pirate I mean pilot. Pirate, pilot. Uh, how do we turn? We go forwards now and turn to the right. Okay. <laughs> we're, not, we're, we're not doing this. Turn. Why are turning? Right I'm turning as hard as I can. We have to do this in unison and this is horrible. Oh, <laughs> God, don't make a No, we stuck it again. I'd like to refer back to my previous statement that we are the worst pirates in history. We might be the worst pirates that you have, you, you've ever heard of, but thank God you've actually heard of us. That's going to do it for the episode today, guys. I hope you're enjoying some of the Atlas shenanigans. I'm having a blastless... Uh, that fell flat, damn it. Why'd you let me sit, Why'd you let me go through with that one, mine? <laughs> I'm having a blast. I want to thank you guys for sticking with us. If you did enjoy this episode, please smash the thumbs up button for us. Let us know that you're enjoying the content. If you haven't done so yet, be sure to subscribe to the page for some more cool videos. Or don't. What the fuck do I know? Who cares? But most importantly of all, always remember to take care of yourselves out there, guys. Stay awesome, and we'll catch you on the next episode on the high seas, if we can get our boat to move properly. <laughs> Later. <laughs> row, row. Wait, what if I? What happens if I row backwards? Hey, you stopped us. <laughs> I ran a stab, so now I can't row anymore. <laughs>